English channel. So in today's video, we're going to be following Won Young's morning routine. She is an it girl and the definition of that girl. And I'm sure there's a couple things that we can learn from her. So let's start with her morning routine since a good morning routine will set the tone for the rest of our day. So if you want to know what Won Young's morning routine looks like, then get cozy and keep on watching. The first thing on this morning routine is going to be having water first thing having water first thing in the morning is the most important it will wake you up and hydrate your body which is very important after not drinking water for hours of sleep and the recommended amount of water is 16 ounces of water in the morning and this part was not mentioned on her morning routine video but I decided to add it because I know that drinking water first thing is very healthy for you so I do this anyway every single day so I decided to keep it that way. The first thing in Won Young's morning routine is stretching for 5 to 10 minutes. This is really good for waking you up and it also helps your body to keep in shape and healthy. I do love stretching in the morning but sometimes I forget and then I go about my day and then I think how did I go the whole day without stretching? I find stretching in the morning is very relaxing and my favorite stretch is the butterfly one and to do this you can either follow a stretching video on youtube or you can do your favorite stretches for five to ten minutes and sometimes i like to play a youtube video while i do my stretches this really entertains me so i usually stretch for longer After stretching, Won Young likes to have one cup of soy milk first thing in the morning before having any breakfast. So we're gonna be having this soy milk that I got specifically for this video and I decided to get this one because it's the healthiest soy milk and I really like it because it doesn't have any additives and it also has zero sugar which is really good. And I got this one at Walmart so it's really easy to find. And I tried it for the first time and it's actually really yummy. And now I'm gonna sit on the couch to have my soy milk. And I believe that soy milk is like beauty milk, so maybe Wang Young knows this too, so that's why she has it every morning. Essentially, soy milk is very rich in antioxidants, omega 3s, and protein, which makes it really good for the body in general, but also the skin, which it makes sense why it's a beauty milk. The next step is Pilates. And Wang Yun's favorite workouts are Pilates and yoga. I'm gonna be changing into my cute workout clothing. This outfit is very Pink Pilates Princess inspired. And I really like cute workout outfits because it really gets me motivated to work out. So today we are doing Pilates. I'm gonna be following this at home Pilates workout video. I'll leave the link of my favorite Pilates videos on the description of this video so that you can try them and also mix and match throughout the week. And I really like Pilates because it feels effective but it's also slow and controlled so it doesn't feel too harsh. I don't like when workouts are too harsh because it's very dreadful like the process. And with Pilates, I feel like I can actually enjoy the process of working out. 
And I actually tried Pilates for the first time while I was doing my um, Wang Yun diet video. And if you haven't seen it, I'll link it somewhere around this video so that you can watch it after this one. And I tried it for the first time there and I absolutely fell in love with Pilates. So ever since, it has become my goal to work out and I like to pair Pilates with some cardio at the gym. Now it's time for dance practice. This part was not mentioned on her morning routine, but I decided to add it as part of the workout portion of the video because she is a dancer and dance is part of her life. So I decided to practice some K-pop dances. And now I'm gonna be changing into a cute cozy outfit because I always see them on their dance practices and they always wear cute but comfy clothing. So I'm gonna be wearing this white joggers with my princess dress hoodie and this is actually my first merch item for my YouTube channel. So I'm really excited and I order mine and I love it so much. It's super cozy because it's fuzzy on the inside and it's perfect for at home, working out or to make a cute outfit. And I've been using it all the time ever since I got it. This sign was made by Nico and I just love it so much. And my merch shop is always on the bottom of the description of my videos. If you scroll down to the comments, you'll see it. And if you want to get one for yourself, you're more than welcome to browse my merch shop. And for my dance practice, I found this really good dance tutorial on YouTube for one of the Eve dances. I haven't danced in, I believe it's been months now, which is really sad because I love dancing. Even if I'm not that good at it, I love doing it for myself and I just find it to be really fun. So I'm happy that I got back into it by doing this video and <laughs> I look so derpy learning this dance. So please ignore that. Now it's time for my favorite part, which is some morning self-care. I'm gonna be showering and then I'm gonna be washing my face with my favorite face cleanser from Pacifica. I really like this because it's creamy, but at the same time, it's kind of jelly and it cleanses your skin really nicely without feeling dry. Now let's go to skincare. I usually start with my rice water toner, but it ran out and I hadn't made it. So we're just gonna jump right into the serum. And the one that I'm using is the Innisfree Green Tea Serum that I got recently. And I love the formula, but the smell is way too strong. Like I've been using it for two weeks now and the formula is amazing, but the smell is so strong that I probably won't be buying it again just because of that. Um, I'll probably be trying another serum next time. So if you have any recommendations for Innisfree serums, please leave them on the comments because I'll be trying some different products from them. Next is the eye cream and the one that I'm using is the one from By Nature. And I really like this one because it feels very refreshing. Next is face oil and I love this one from The Ordinary. It's the rosehip one and it's super hydrating. I love to lather and just put a bunch of oil on my face. I just love face oil. I feel like it's my favorite part of the skincare routine. Now the last step is moisturizer and I absolutely love this one from Pacifica because it's really hydrating and it also has sunscreen which makes my life way easier because I used to apply moisturizer first and then apply sunscreen separately. And now it's just one step and I'm done. And honestly, it's one of the best moisturizers I've tried. So since I tried it for the first time, this is already like my third or fourth bottle of this. So it's really, really good. Now we're gonna be having breakfast. I'm going to get some yogurt with fruit. Yogurt and fruit is definitely one of my favorite breakfasts ever. And the yogurt that I'm using is the So Delicious one and I have a couple spoonfuls of it and then I will sweeten it with some stevia. And then 
I like to top it with granola and fruit. I'm gonna be having frozen blueberries, mangoes, and peaches. And my guilty pleasure is agave. I don't know why, but I just love agave so much. Even just seeing agave, I just want to eat it. Like, I think, what can I put agave on? So I love to top my yogurt with some agave, even though I know it would be better without it. But with it, it just tastes amazing. Now, let's get ready. We're doing our makeup first. I'm going to be following um, this one makeup routine from this video of the official makeup artist showing how they do it. And I'm also going to be using this picture for reference because I really like how their makeup looks in here. And this is not a tutorial. I'm just going to be showing you guys the process that I go through and doing this makeup. And I'm just going to be applying my concealer and my base. Then I'm going to be applying the eyeshadow. And I really thought the eyeshadow was going to be like spot on in the color. But when I put it on, it was way peachier but it's okay it still looks good so i went with it and now i'm doing my eyeliner and in the video the makeup artist said to use eyeshadow as eyeliner so i'm gonna be trying this for the first time and i actually liked it a lot because it looks more natural feeling in my eyebrows and then i'm gonna be curling my eyelashes and applying some mascara now I'm doing my lips and on the video I said to line the lips before applying lipstick so that's what I'm doing and as for the color the one that I had it was pretty spot on with the one that she used in the videos so I was really happy about that I'm finishing up the makeup with some blush and then as the last step I'll be adding some lip gloss and this is the finished look and this is not the first time that I try Wonyeon's makeup but I really like Wonyeon's makeup because it's very dolly and like cute but natural at the same time I feel like it goes really well with my style and then I'm gonna be doing my hair and ignore that my hair is uh, kind of greasy but we're gonna work with it and now I'm just straightening my hair and then curling at the bottom and I have to clip my bangs to the side because right now they're too short. I actually had let them grow, but I caved and I cut them back. <laughs> I just really love bangs, so I, I like the change. So I went back to bangs and now I have to clip them back if I want to do the middle parting. And that's what I'm going to be doing. I'm going to be clipping them to the side. And also I'm going to be using a headband for this look because I've noticed that headbands is a pretty iconic look for Wonyoung. As you can see, she uses them a lot. So I'm going to be adding it into this look. And now we're done with hair and makeup. We're ready to choose our outfit. And I'm going to be doing a Wonyoung inspired outfit. And I've already done a couple inspired outfits by Wonyoung that you probably might have seen on my shorts or TikTok. So I already know kind of an idea of what I'm going to be doing. The one that I decided to go for was this floral dress with the pink jacket, the white boots, and the purple bag. So we're choosing our outfit. Now we're ready. And I really like this look. I feel like it's really sweet and cutesy. But the boots give it a more edgy look. Well, this is the end of today's video. I really hope that you liked this video and that I got you inspired. And that you can take a couple things that you can incorporate into your morning routine. Thank you so much for watching this video, guys. And I'll see you in my next one. Bye!